Hi, we're Roy and Karen. This is our week in the villages. How did it start? Well, we started out having some fun with our snowflake neighbors that we love when they come into town and we get to visit and spend time with them. They said, uh, we'll do anything you want as long as it has to do with golf. Yes. And so, since our level of golf is still on the putt and play, that's where we went. It's the Fanny putt and play. Mm -hmm. And it was a lot of fun. Yeah. Uh, you got a hole in one? Got a hole in one? No, you didn't. Kind of. No, you didn't. Courtesy of a little bit of editing. <laughs> and then we did one of our favorite things in the whole world. We caravaned over to Brownwood. Yeah. I don't remember what who the band was. Uh, they were they were pretty good. Mm -hmm. They were pretty good. Yeah. Hadn't seen them before. Yeah, and we got to meet one of our fans. Brenda stopped to you say know, hi. It, it's so odd uh, for us because we go out and we really don't think about that we have a YouTube channel. We're just going out to enjoy ourselves. I mean, we it it was the folks we were with who took out their iPhone <laughs> and took this picture of, of Brenda saying hi to us. We don't even think about it. We don't prepare, we don't. We're still trying to get used to this whole idea. Yeah. It's okay. But, uh, hi Brenda. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. <laughs> uh, then, you know, Saturday morning, I'm gonna go out and find some place to do some photography. Uh, on the way to Magnolia Plaza, uh, I, we, we are always passing by the Loblolly Golf Course. Mm -hmm. And there's this lake there, and it's got a big alligator in it, but we're not seeing them right now. But it's, it's a nice long pond, and the birds like to hang out there. So I did some, some shooting over there. Mm -hmm. uh, but next week, uh, the mayor of Hammock, if any, is back in town, and it looks like we may have a couple new uh, photography buddies that uh, will be uh, going out with it this weekend. The I'm boys, excited. The boys group. Yeah, I'm, I'm liking it. So Roy was out doing his, his weekend errand thing, and yeah. we've just been talking about how nice it is with the warm weather to have the windshield down on the golf cart. I was done with my little photo shoot, and I ran off to Brownwood to get gas. And lo and behold, who do I see? <laughs> Wayne. Wayne who makes the window screens for, for golf carts. We'd seen him in the square during uh -huh. market nights, but we haven't gone to one of those in a while. Well, we, we thought we would go to one and do it, and then lo and behold, there he there is, he on, is. The, on the side of Prayer the road. <laughs> uh, so I went ahead and bought it. And I really, I took a couple of pictures of him, but I didn't interview him. I didn't want to give a recommendation for him because I hadn't really used it. Well, I, I picked up the window screen, I went to Brownwood to get gas, and I was blown away by it. So on the way back home, I stopped off to say hi to Wayne again. And this is the video you're gonna see. I didn't want to say anything until I took it for a drive. All right. And now I'm like, why the hell didn't I do this months ago? Pretty nice, isn't it? Yeah. What do you want to say? I think the screen is the best thing you can buy for your golf cart for enjoyment. Well, I have to disagree. These bucket seats, these things are the bomb. Yeah. But I would say that's a pretty close second right now in August. I, I have people stop every day and say, that's, I don't know how I survived without it. You know, I, uh, I just wish I could get people to buy one, drive up to that corner, turn around and drive back. That's, that's usually all it takes. Wayne, thank you, sir. All right, have a great day. So one of the things I've been wanting to do was to do a little fishing. I'm not really worried about the catching part. It's just the fishing. It's just the the meditation that comes with casting your line, reeling it back in, 
casting it out, reeling it back in. It's okay if you never catch anything. So, I did it for the first time this weekend. The problem is, and I didn't think this through, the problem is that there's an alligator in every one of these ponds. At least one. Many and, times, many more. <laughs> and this guy that you're seeing behind me, he kept trying to get my lure. And every time I would throw the lure somewhere else, he would go try to try to chase it down. I finally just playing, gave up. It's like playing fetch with the alligators. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I wasn't worried about him getting me. I was more worried about getting the hook out of his mouth. <laughs> so I just gave up. But it was a, it was fun, and I'm, I'm going to try it again. I'm going to go somewhere else, mm -hmm. maybe a, a slightly larger pond. Uh, we'll see how that goes. So Sawgrass Grove has opened, and we haven't had a chance to go there. And that was on the list of things to do. We finally got the opportunity and hopped in the golf cart, and off we went. And, and we videotaped the whole video thing. To, or managed to record the whole thing, except we found out when we were all done that it didn't go. <laughs> we lost all of that. So we found out later. We had our enjoyable fish tacos and listened to some music and checked out all the new places there. So two days later, we went back again and Roy did a quick once around. No, Sunday morning, I just went in there and did what you're seeing behind us. Uh, and nobody was there. When we had gone the first time, there was live music, and the bar was packed, and uh, everything was hopping. They had samples of pizza out there, for, and I took pictures of it. Uh, now I got this to show you. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, it is what it is. What are you gonna do? Well, what you do is you find out why you're losing footage, because the next thing we did is we went for a golf cart ride to celebrate 80 years of marriage. We're 27 years of marriage, and we have uh, our neighbors, uh, they've got 29 years. years of marriage, and then our friends down the street, who, 24 years of marriage. Kitty and Kevin, mm -hmm. 24 years, and they were celebrating their anniversary that day, mm -hmm. Sunday night. Mm -hmm. And our anniversary is going to be this Friday. Mm -hmm. Uh, the combined total is 80. I'm trusting she did the math correctly. I'm not double checking her. Uh, <laughs> if you got, if she's wrong, please leave in the comments. <laughs> but again, and we, maybe I should find another career if I can't add. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, again, we lost the footage. All we have is what what I'm showing you here. We took the golf cart ride. And we went up to Arnold Palmer. Arnold Palmer. That was a nice ride. You know, beautiful Rainy ride. Day, but we were well, enjoying it. We don't we worry about did. the rain. You know, it, uh, the two other couples we were with, they had their enclosures, enclosures down. down. And we had ours open. You know, learned you just go. Don't just stop. Go. And the yeah. rain just goes like. <laughs> <laughs> but it was a nice meal. A little on the pricey side. Yeah. But great company. Great setting. Enjoyed the food. And it, I, it I can't nice. say anything bad about Arnold Palmer, the legacy restaurant. The only thing I can say though is I still enjoyed Nancy Lopez more. And if we had another special occasion coming up, I would probably choose Nancy Lopez over Arnold Palmer. But we hadn't been there yet, so we had we no had to go and check it reference out. Reference point. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. uh, I would like to recommend to you guys that you watch this video over here and you will find out all kinds of other fun stuff that there is to do around the villages. Mm -hmm. So, we appreciate you stopping by. See ya!